Hey, kings and queens. So what we're gonna talk about today is um, shingles. So my inspiration for this was for my mom who um, was diagnosed with shingles. That's the, just a quick uh, backdrop of the story. And um, she wasn't getting any relief uh, from what the doctors gave her. So I came up with this um, formula and it seems to work. Uh, this is one of my number one sellers. This is right up there in the top three. So let's get into this video. Uh, the ingredients that we're gonna be working with is St. John's wort, cayenne pepper, yellow dock, arnica, um, blue lotus, chickweed, plankton, yarrow, oregano, and licorice root, neem, and um, let's see, beeswax, and then we've got uh, lemon balm, and we have um, some shea butter, okay? So, and the oils that was used is coconut oil, um, sweet almond oil, and grapeseed oil. So, right here, I've already melted my beeswax, okay, because we, we're trying to save time. And I have already strained my herbal infused oil over here. I'm just gonna move this out the way. Um, so, I read out the ingredients to you all. Um, this is, everything that I named was herbal infused into this oil. Now, what I'm gonna do now is add in my shea butter. And it shouldn't take too long for this to melt. I'm gonna turn it up again. Turn it down a little bit. Okay. And get this going. And we're also gonna be adding in oregano essential oil. And we're gonna add in some um, um, aloe vera and some blue lotus absolute. And we're also gonna add in some vitamin E oil. Okay, so we're just gonna get this good and melted. And while this is melting, I'm gonna go ahead and move some of this stuff out of the way. Oh, and we're also gonna go ahead and add in a preservative. We're gonna use Optifin. Um, it's all natural. Um, I, I actually love this preservative. Um, I use it quite a bit. So I'm just gonna get some of this stuff out of the way while the um, shea butter is melting. Get this just melted because when you're dealing with shea butter um, you don't want to leave it cooking too long because it can become very grainy of course everybody knows that from doing the um, body butters so let's get this good and melted and I noticed that if you stir it a little bit while it's melting it speeds up the process so that didn't take too long Now we're going to add in the um, oil, herbal infused oil, and the stars of this show is actually lemon balm, um, neem, licorice root, and cayenne pepper. Don't remember if I uh, mentioned that or not, but you definitely, we try to address um, everything that has to do with shingles as far as um, the nerve pain, the deep nerve pain. Um, it's really hard to get to, and that is where St. John's work comes in. Um, and it does wonders for nerve pain. I'm actually thinking about adding in another ingredient, um, that the mimosa, that's also for um, nerve pain. Um, Jamaican, um, Dogwood, that is for nerve pain. So I'm gonna turn it down just a little because I don't want it to overboil. But this should melt up. And again, you don't want it too high because you don't want to burn your oils. You still want it to have all the medicinal properties. So it should be melting. And we're gonna go ahead and use the exact same container. Turn it down a little more. Looks like it's trying to boil over on me. 
Okay. <laughs> Turn it down some more. Y'all, I really am not used to this thing yet. So, look at that. Oh boy. Let me lift it up a little bit. Okay. Put that down. See what we got. Oh, still on the plate. Okay, let me get some paper towel and wipe this up. Okay. So it is melting. So what I'm going to do now, I'm going to start adding in some of my... Ooh, oh, melting perfectly, y'all. Look at that. Look at that beautiful orange color. That comes from that cayenne. And uh, cayenne is perfect. It's a perfect additive for um, shingles. Okay. Things we have misplaced. Oh, here we go. All right. And I'm gonna add in some oregano essential oil. This has great medicinal properties to it. Almost uh, antibiotic-like. Okay. And so I'm just going to stir it up a little bit. Getting ready to take this off in just a second. And I'm probably going to go ahead and take it off because when I add in my preservative, I don't want this too hot. So I'm going to go ahead and pour it into the um, back into this container over here. So we're just going to pour this back in. Look at that color. So now I'm going to add in a little bit of the um, Blue Lotus Absolute. chickweed um, I think I mentioned that uh, for the itch licorice root for the itch stops it in its track licorice root almost acts like a steroid um, so this is really really good for shingles um, like I said uh, lemon balm licorice root neem uh, neem is another um, good antiseptic that is good for the skin Everything that I made is really, really good for the skin. I'm just going to get this part. Uh, yeah. So, um, this was wonders. Wonders for my mom. It's worked wonders for several um, people that have bought it. Feedback on it has been all positive. I've had people say that doctors have broken prescriptions and they did not work. And this helped them. This, this is the only thing that actually worked for them. Now, I'm not saying don't take your um, prescribed medication, I'm just telling you what my reviews were the feedback that I got so 
I'm gonna let this cool a little bit, but I'm gonna show you um, what it looks like and just show you the consistency of it. And it goes on smooth. I mean, it smells good, uh, feels good, works instantly. So, if you like this video, please hit the like button, like and subscribe, and hit that notification bell.